hello guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys some affordable fragrances that would definitely not break the bank they are high quality long lasting and they are just wonderful overall like you literally do not need to break the bank in order to smell good and i know you have heard this saying somewhere before but it's true you really do not need too much in order to smell good like there are actually some expensive fragrances that do not smell good these that are less expensive that are one of the best things that you would ever smell it really depends on the fragrance so i'm definitely going to show you guys about six fragrances that are quite affordable but first please do not forget to like comment and subscribe so part of this video is sponsored by an arabian perfume brand they sell arabian fragrances that varies from different brands that you can ever think of they sell really affordable fragrances you guys should definitely check them out they are called the mason the arabia arabian store and they have their instagram i'm going to put it on the screen you guys should go follow them they have really nice fragrances i'm going to show you some of their top sellers go show you the best fragrances that they have that are quite affordable high quality and long lasting so guys the first fragrance i'm going to talk about is blueberry moth and this is the box that it comes in the packaging is always luxurious and this is the bottle this is blueberry mox this is my favorite one guys like just check this bottle out so blueberry mox this is a realistic blueberry fragrance with musk but it's sensual, it's crumbled, it's like whipped cream and blueberries just mixed together. It's really sweet. There has to be a really nice note. And when it dries down, you are just left with that sensual musk. This is a really nice one, guys. It's long lasting. This lasts for a really long time. The one is just like beautiful. It's, this is just a very beautiful look. It projects as long lasting. I just love how this smells, guys. I think I'm going to spray it. The thing is that whenever I spray this fragrance, I always have to wait for the dry down to um, get off the alcohol scent. Yeah, this is where the beauty of the fragrance comes in. It has that um, Arabian kind of vibes. The blueberries are just tart, a little bit tart, very realistic, and you can literally just smell those blueberries. Get your hands on these guys. If you are looking to try something different, because I haven't really smelled anything like blueberry musk. If you are looking to try something different, definitely check this out, guys. Mason de Arabia, definitely because this is one of their best and this is one of their top sellers so far so the next one guys this is inspired by Amani C but let me tell you guys so this one is just uh, it's just thicker and beautiful like just look at the bottle guys no just look at this bottle bottle is heavy is a 3.4 ounce and this is by arabian it's like an arabian brand it's going to be on the screen and this is lampsat her hair is really nice it's decadent the black current notes is really it's really vivid in here but i feel like it adds a lot of tubaros in it it has more tuberose in here than the original Amanisi itself. This is why I actually prefer this one. Because when I first bought Amanisi back 2020, 
I think it was for my birthday present. See, it smelled way better than this my recent bottle because I just got a new bottle of Amanisi after about two years, two, three years. I just got a bottle this year. So my bottle ran out back in 2021 and I never got a bottle till this year. My Amani C smells a bit off. It's not what I remembered the original Amani C to be. And my, I think the juice is a little bit darker how my bottle was originally when I got it back in 2020. And it sure doesn't smell the way I actually thought it would smell because there was a reason why I got it. But with Lampsat, I definitely get what this, my bottle of Amani C is missing. I definitely see what it's missing in here. It's like the Tuba Rose is really prominent in here and it, it intertwines with the black currant notes. This nice size, much more potent and it's going to last longer for nights out, in my opinion. Yeah, so Lamsa Tahir, please give this a try, guys. Right. The third bottle is Majestic Rose. And this is the bottle. The it did start so no. This is a really, this is a really pretty bottle in my opinion. It one smells like Lavia El Bell by Lancome. There is absolutely no difference. I can't smell any difference. I used to have the original, the original Lavia El Bell by Lancome, but I decluttered it because I just, I just smelt it too often. But when I smelt Majestic Rose, I actually missed Lavia Airbell because of how good this one smells like. This one is really nice. It's a floral, white floral fragrance. So if you're that kind of girl that just loves white florals and you do not want to spend that much money on Navia Airbell by Nancom. You definitely need to get this. Honestly, like this with the longevity and the price tag, this is a win for me, in my opinion. Like it's a win. I'm definitely going to be keeping this in my collection because I actually do miss the kind of same profile. Yeah, this is yeah, this is wonderful. So guys, get your hands on this one, Majestic Rose. So the first one is, but well, the name is called the Year. And this is the bottle presentation, guys. Bottle, the presentations, they're like so exquisite. Like, they are not playing with the packaging, guys. This is the bottle. Like, just beautiful. This actually smells like the intense fashion of Amani C. So if you are looking to try Amani C, the intense fashion for less than the price, definitely check this out. It has a darker black currant note that is really nice and sensual and perfect for nights out. So definitely check this out. It's similar to, so this one, this one is like the darker fashion, like the darker and more intense fashion of Lamsat, in my opinion. But they smell really similar, same similar scent profiles. So definitely, if you are looking for the more affordable fashion of Amani C, please, please, please check this out first. As you can see with the packaging, the longevity, you really can't go wrong with these fragrances. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. Please do not forget to like, comment and subscribe videos. Let me know 
what do you guys think of this video and i was actually just trying to make this video brief i did not want to bore you guys with you know so much information thank you so much for watching this video and i'll see you guys in the next video stay blessed bye